Hey guys, welcome to another amazing episode of Keetana Cooks. Today let's see how to make egg masala. This egg masala goes well with chapati and parotta. This is an amazing side dish recipe. If you happen to try this recipe, please let me know in the comment section how it worked out for you. Now let's get started. For this recipe, I'm going to roast the eggs to give a good texture. For that, I'm adding 1 tablespoon of oil to a hot pan, adding in 1 teaspoon of chili powder, 1 teaspoon of coriander powder, half a teaspoon of turmeric powder, and some salt. Now let's mix the masalas nicely in a very low flame. Make sure the flame is very low or else the masalas might get burnt. Now I'm adding in 5 boiled eggs. Let's coat all the masalas over the eggs. We need to cook until the skin turns nice and crispy. Our eggs are now completely done. Let's take and keep it aside. Now in the same pan, I'm going to add 2 more teaspoons of oil and few spices. Adding in 1 inch of cinnamon. 3 cardamom and 3 cloves, adding in 1 teaspoon of cumin, around 1 teaspoon of fennel seeds, 1 inch of ginger and 5 to 6 garlic cloves. Let's cook it nicely. Once the garlic is cooked and roasted nicely, let's start adding our onion. I have chopped around quarter onion around 1 by 4 cup of onion very finely now let's add the onions to the pan we need to saute until the onions turn golden brown our goal is to get a depth of flavor so our ginger garlic and onion everything should be roasted nicely adding in half cup of chopped tomatoes this is around one medium sized tomato Once our tomatoes are cooked nice and soft, let's add around 6 whole cashew nuts, a teaspoon of poppy seeds, 2 tablespoons of freshly grated coconut. Let's give it up a quick mix. Once you add the coconuts, do not cook it for a long time. Now this mixture is ready to be grinded. I have taken my blender here, adding in the ingredients to the blender and I'm going to grind it into a very fine paste. Our masala paste is now ready. Now let's do the egg masala. To a pan I'm adding around 2 tablespoons of sesame oil. Once the oil is nice and hot, let's add in our finely chopped onion. This is around 1 cup of chopped onion. We need to cook until the onion turns brown, adding in 2 green chilies. Our onions have turned brown. Now I'm going to add the masala powder around 1 tablespoon of coriander powder and 2 teaspoon of chili powder. You can adjust the spices according to your taste. Now the oil is oozing out from the sides. So it's time to add our grinded masala paste at this stage. I'm going to add this masala paste. Let's cook it for around 2 minutes. Once it comes out from the sides, Let's add in around 1 cup of water to dilute it. You can add water based on your preference. If you want it a little bit thinner, you can add around 1.5 to 2 cups water. Adding in around 1 teaspoon of pepper. We need to cover and cook at least 20 minutes in a medium flame. Our egg masala is almost ready. I'm going to make small slits and add our eggs to the masala and cook for 5 more minutes. Let's garnish it with a little bit of cilantro leaves. Our tasty and yummy egg masala is ready to be served with some hot parathas. If you like this recipe, make sure to comment, like and subscribe to my channel Keetana Cooks. See you soon with another recipe.